Welcome, welcome. Today we're gonna be talking about solar activities ramping up faster than science is predicted. Internet apocalypse is near. So this one right here, I don't know what to say. This is a nigga future. I don't know what to. I don't know what to say. This shit right here is uh. <laughs> I mean. Uh, Niggas still gonna ignore it regardless. Like, it's not even like it's one of them things, you know what I mean? But still, just one of the niggas trying to tell you that claims that a solar storm can cause such an event within the next decade. That's hard to ignore, my nigga. And I know niggas want to ignore It's just, it's, it's hard for me to ignore when a niggas. It's it's damn near the you know what I mean? This is this is the motherfucking trumpet. Uh what is the internet apocalypse? So pretty much solar storm that can potentially cause a large scale internet outage, causing entire globe or covering the entire globe for several months. Shit like that. That's that stone age shit. Like that's that. That's that. Like, like it's really hard for you to come back, just due to the fact that niggas' mindsets would already have changed. Like, possibly 24 hours after this whole shit went down, and we didn't have internet. Cause I, I just want you to understand. Like, my phone. If my phone don't have internet. I might as well just toss it in the grass. There's nothing else I could do with my phone when that bitch ain't got. It. I mean, you could hit a, you could make a call. Look, I'm, if you, I'm not saying you don't use your phone for calling, but I FaceTime. So, <laughs> so regardless, it's I need, I need, <laughs> I need I, mobile. I, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I. I don't know if I can stay on a constant mobile. I don't know if I could do that. But right here, if if 1859 had certain buildings that were getting burned down, if a nigga went to his wall and unplugged his, I don't even know what the fuck you would call this machine. Unplug that bitch. And you telling me it, it caught on fire. Something that's made out of... Nigga, that shit is 85% wood. That shit ain't even... That shit probably ain't even got two wires on it. Still caught on fire. Like, if you telling me that I shouldn't, like, uh, fear when everything in our society is technologically based, these niggas finna come out with an Apple headset. Sadly, I might cop it. Sadly, yeah. Like, if a solar storm was to happen and a nigga is in the meta, you see what I'm saying? That whole shit gets malfunctioned and blows your top off. I don't understand. I don't. It, it, it's like, it's like, it, bro, it's, it's gonna cause so much. Like, when that storm happens. We're already gonna be too deep in that hole to where, see me, I pay attention to the space weather, so I'll be alerted, ready, to, nigga, I'll alert myself, fuck are you talking, I'm not waiting for a nigga to tell me, so, at the moment I see the big one, <laughs> hey, 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 and the thing is, the way that our magnetosphere is now is pretty weak, uh, our Earth's magnetic field also, uh, depends heavily on the sun uh we do have uh some type of symbiotic i wouldn't call it symbiotic but i would call it a uh there's some type of sync in in our relationship uh when you're dealing with the sun and you're dealing with the earth's magnetic field um pretty much i mean we all know that the magnetic field is there to protect us from things like solar flares uh solar wind filament eruptions um the sun could do a lot of things and shoots a lot of harmful rays but 
nature provides filters that you could even uh, use to uh, absorb those rays and kind of take them in and use them for something. So it's not uh, ever a wasted cycle with nature. But this shit right here, an internet apocalypse. If 1859 was as bad as niggas talking about this shit finna, I don't understand how it's just gonna turn off our shit and we just gonna go back to normal. Nigga, niggas is not stocking up on the food and all that extra crazy shit, so I already know for a fact, I already know for a fact, niggas are gonna be cannibalizing niggas, yeah? Like, no, like, that's what I'm saying, like, niggas don't even care about news like this see what i'm saying uh even something as like uh small as a g4 storm would cause voltage control problems as well as surface charging tracking problems on spacecrafts satellite navigation low frequency navigation and uh, uh, can also be disturbed that's what a g4 now a G5 would probably that would be the that would be the call. I don't know what the what what else to say on that one. I put the little um, header on so you can kind of see what each storm would do G1 through five. But the sun is able to I mean take us out right now. So I don't really the whole uh, even when you're scaling it, you gotta change. They they need to update the scale because the 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 Earth's magnetic field is also weakening. So it probably won't even take a G4 or not G4. It probably won't take a G5 storm to do the trick. That's why they're probably saying G4. Because I mean we are getting weaker. But um, can solar activity really cause global internet blackouts? Yes, it can. It could cause global internet blackouts on a global scale like they, there's no avoiding this motherfucking as you can see with the Carrington event in 1859 during that event uh, was described as a white flare flash from the sun according to space.com it turned out that the coronal mass ejection that hit the earth less than eight do you know the speed you have to be going to reach earth in 18 hours when you got 93 million miles to go I don't know what to say. Uh, a happening that uh, usually takes days. A day later, telegraph systems worldwide went haywire. Literally shocking operators when settling telegraph papers on fire. And, set and even setting telegraph papers on fire. So, niggas was getting shocked. I mean, what the fuck do you think is going to happen now? My room is gonna set the whole neighborhood on fire. Like I'ma just be respectful. This shit is. This shit ain't even gonna make. I can't unplug. Ev niggas can't unplug everything, dog. Like niggas, can and it's not gonna happen. Like that's the thing. So, and the way our houses are built, bro, it's just built for disaster. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to tell a nigga. We built for disaster, but pretty much that's all they had to say. We are in so solar cycle 25, so um, this is actually grand solar cycle 25, which is grand solar maximum. So you have this thing called grand solar maximum and grand solar minimum. Minimum would be when the sun is less active. They're both 11 year cycles. Um, uh, one is, which is the minimum, is when the sun is not that active maximum which is we're in right now that scientists are actually saying we're two years ahead of ahead of uh the projected time or the predicted activity was supposed to be in 2025 great job so <laughs> some shit like this you really can't ignore uh it has the literally your future in its motherfucking hand and uh if you choose to ignore it You'll be having that Apple headset on while shit going haywire and your head gonna blow wide the fuck open with no problems and no issues. Appreciate that. <laughs> shit, I, I appreciate, I appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all niggas. <laughs>